Good morning, my dear students. So, have you enjoyed the weekends? Good. So, I think all of you have completed the home assignments. So, please keep it on my table. I will check it after the class. Okay? So then, how many of you know about chess? Yes, play chess. You know. Okay then, one question. So I have a model chess board. You know how many columns are in the chess board, right? Yes, 64. But, my question is, what will be the total length around a chess board? Total length around. So from here to here, 8 units, here 8, 8, here also 8. So 4 times 8, 32. Then, what will be the total space inside this? Total space, yes. How we can find? So we told there are 64 columns, that means 64 squares, small squares, right? So just we can find the area also. So here the total space is 64 squares. Then the total space is called area. So area we are going to study today. Area. Okay. Then I will show you a figure. What is the name? Name of the figure? Yes, it is a rectangle. Then find the area of the rectangle. Yes, like the previous one. So just by counting the number of squares, you will get the area. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Right? 6 squares. So area is 6 squares. Then Always area will be explaining, will be telling in square unit. So I will give you some knots. Area. The amount of space inside the boundary of a flat object that object should be two dimensional what do you mean by two dimensional it's only length and breadth two dimensional so look here is the picture this is the boundary and here look at the shaded part that shaded part is the inside part so that is the area then i told area we are expressing in square unit example Unit of length, if it is in centimeter, then unit of area, that should be centimeter power 2, that is square centimeter. And if it is in meter, it is square meter, so meter power 2, so kilometer also like that. Understood? Very good. So, here is the question. Find out the area of this figure. Yes, just by counting. So, how many complete squares are there? Yes, there are nine. Then, so other parts? Yes, that is half of a square. Very good. So, here also half. So, that two halves will join to one. Yes, so it is nine plus one. It is 10 squares. Very good. 10 squares. Then, I will give you some models. You can find the area by your own. Take it for you. For you. For you. Make it fast. Yes. 16. Very good. 24. Exactly. 
48. Yes, keep it, keep it up, keep it up. Then, so I will give you an exercise. Find the area of the following figures. One, two, three questions are there. Yes. One, need to draw the pictures. So just turn down. Yes. Just write in your books. Yes. Nine. Yes. Very good. So I think all of you understood the concept. So before ending the class, I will just tell you the main points once again. So here, area, the amount of space inside the boundary of a flat object. That is called area. Yes. And area we are always expressing in square unit. If it is in centimeter, centimeter square, meter, meter square. If it is kilometer, kilometer square. It's like that. So then I will give you some assignment for tomorrow. For you, for you, yes, look at that part first, yes. yes, I think all of you enjoy the class, see you tomorrow, thank you.